little bit of a haul for you and I've got a massive thank you to do which I'm going to do at the end. Um, I've been a couple of places and I've ordered a couple of bits online so I just thought I'd show you what I've got. It's nothing particularly exciting. Um, I ordered some stuff from Matalan online because um, I had a 20% off thing and I needed some summer basics but I'm really disappointed because out of everything that I ordered I'm only keeping two things for myself and two things for me and the rest has all got to go back because their sizing is very strange in Matalan and um, I mean I bought that top the other day and that was really nice but the other the basics that I've bought are really small cut so I'm not very impressed but anyway all I got from Matalan in the end was two basic cami tops and these are to wear underneath things like I wear my nude one all the time as you know so I've now got a black one and a white one these are in two different sizes the white one is a 20 and the black one is an 18 these were only they were listed at three pound each but because of the 20% off I think I got them for like 240 so that was pretty good and like I said they're just basic long stretchy camis and I wear them under things so that's all I've got from Matalan. Um, I ordered a coat from New Look because I wanted a new coat anyway. Not necessarily for now because it's, although it is really windy today, it's more for when the cold weather comes back. And uh, it's very, very plain. It's just like black and pleated and it's got a hood. But I mainly got it because it's waterproof and it was really cheap. So I thought, right, I'm going to have it. It's a very basic as you can see very very boring but it's ideal for work and it's not too thick I can't stand thick coats because they get really hot this was originally um, $24.99 which was then reduced to £12 it says on here but I got it for seven seven quid for a coat you can't really argue with that at all I thought that was a really good price so I got that um, and then I went to Asda Living the other day if you follow me on Instagram, you'll know I've got some candles. But I also got this. Now, this is actually a night shirt. But recently, I've been obsessed with Czech shirts. And I got this one. And it's really pretty, like, lavender and purple and grey Czech. Really, really nice. And like I said, this is a night shirt, so it's long, which I love. It's a 20 to 22, I believe. Um, the only night shirty bit about it, really, is the pocket's got a little bit of frill on it that doesn't really matter and you can wear it as a normal shirt and it looks nice so I got that that was £10 reduced to five and then I got four Yankee these are called samplers but they're basically like tall tea lights um, I bought five and I gave one to my mum so the ones that I got these are called simply home I think that's why they're cheaper this one is called shoreline and oh my god it smells so pretty. I can't describe scents, but it's it's a little bit florally, um, a little bit linen. It's just, oh, it's so good. And I love that these were only a pound because they had the tarts as well, and the tarts were a pound, but these were also a pound, so I thought, oh, I'm going to get these. But I'm not going to break these ones up because they've got a wick in them. I'm just going to burn them. So I've got Shoreline. I've got um, Lavender Spa, which smells really good as well because it smells like lavender but it's not really overpowering because I love the scent of lavender anyway it makes me think of my nan but this kind of lavender but with like a sweetness to it it's really really nice then I got sugared vanilla because I love bakery scents and this is lovely because it's vanilla-y but it's like got a hint of sweetness like a different sweetness to it it's not just vanilla it smells really pretty and then this is my favourite one and I always get ones like this and this is vanilla frosting and this just smells like vanilla cupcake oh. <laughs> I love vanilla frosting and I love like cupcake and stuff so very very happy with all of those and like I said they were a pound each um, and then I got a package yesterday I will have one more thing to show you because Mark bought me a present which hasn't come yet but I know what it is um, I had a package come from my absolutely amazing friend Alison. Um, she is on. She doesn't do videos on YouTube, but she does have a YouTube account, which is Shiny Happy Bean. But um, I call her Mama Bear. She's just really been there for me lately. It's really been there for me lately, and um, I was feeling really down last week. And she said, "Look, I've got you a couple of bits. I want to send you a package to try and cheer you up a bit." And, I was so appreciative of that because she didn't obviously have to do that. Nobody has to send me gifts, 
But um, it came yesterday. She sent some stuff for Immy as well, which was really, really sweet. Of um, so yeah, she sent me a package. So it came with a card as well, but I always keep my cards private. She sent me these lashes. They're bourgeois lashes. Look at them. I have no clue what I'm going to do with these things, but they are absolutely amazing. They're so good. And they're supposed to kind of look like that. You can put them on the top or on the bottom. You can cut them up. I just think they're absolutely amazing. I don't think you would wear the whole thing. I mean, you can, but I don't think you'd need to. You just sort of cut a bit of it off. But I absolutely love these. They're amazing. And she sent me... Now, this is so awesome because the present that mark's got me he's got me a wonder woman purse and it's like a clutch purse and the only issue i have with purses like that is that they've got a tiny little coin bit and it's a real pain in the ass and if you've got a lot of change you can't fit it in so the wonder woman purse he's got me is going to fit my cards and my notes in and then they don't talk to each other they don't know each other but alison got me this little coin purse from New Look and I've seen these before and this was just so amazing that she got me this because it's going to fit with my Wonder Woman purse so well not just because of the colours but because it's comic book and because it's a coin purse so it's, they've really like they both know me so well so yeah she got me this which I love it's just plain on the back and she also got me two pairs of earrings I've got so many lovely earrings lately I've got some gorgeous skull earrings from Nikki and I've got some lovely cross and skull earrings from Shell and now I've got two pairs of earrings from, from Alison so I'm going to have to stop wearing these all the time and start putting some in the bottom. She's got me these owl ones which are really cute. I know that um, Chocky Cows will love these if she hasn't got them because she loves owls. So I've got those and then she got me these which really make me think of Betsy Johnson these things, these bows because they're so big and chunky they just make me think of Betsy Johnson and they're so cute they're gonna look really cute in so I've got those and then I actually opened this first this next one this is the last thing and I got so excited so it came in this box and I was like oh it's gonna be like jewelry or something and there was a little bag inside and I opened the bag and this is what I found inside I found this bracelet so Hang on. Yeah, it's this bracelet and it's um, it's all like tarnished beads and then you get the odd sparkly one and it's got this ribbon kind of wound through it and then it's got these charms on it so you've got a heart charm and you've got this big metal one with the skull on it and then you've got this little spider one with gems hanging off of it. And then this little one here that has the Betsy Johnson logo on it. This is Betsy Johnson on the back. And I was just like, Betsy freaking Johnson, are you kidding me? Now, don't know if it's real or not, but I really don't care because it's just absolutely gorgeous. I kind of hope it's not real because if it is real, then I'm like... Why have you spent so much money on me? Because Betsy Johnson isn't cheap. I mean, this label says um, $55 on it. So if you kind of converted that into pounds, it'd probably be about 30 quid. So I really, really hope that um, she hasn't spent 30 pound on me. I really hope she hasn't. But um, whether it's real or fake, I really don't care because it's absolutely gorgeous. I absolutely, I love this so much. It's so me. And I was just like, oh my God, oh my God, when I got it. I was so excited. But um, this is what it looks like on. Obviously try and ignore the tag, but um, yeah. It's just so, so pretty. And it's so me and I love it. It's absolutely gorgeous. So... Alison just thank you so so much for just not just for this but for being such an amazing friend and such an amazing mama bear to me you, you really you don't know how much you've helped me just lately but um this is just it's just gorgeous and I just thank you so much for it I'm so happy and excited and I'm just like ah, it's 
like Christmas because it was all wrapped up with ribbon and Hello Kitty stickers and I was just like ah rip 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 so it was very exciting I was going to put it on camera I was going to film it on camera but um I looked I mean I don't look much better today I don't know what's going on with this but um I looked in absolute state yesterday because it was so windy and I'd been out and my hair did not look brilliant it looked a bit greasy and it was just like Ugh. so I didn't go on camera yesterday but um I'm so made up with everything I just cannot believe this I cannot believe how spot on both you and Mark were I'm so impressed that like I've now got two purses that kind of go together I'm so impressed with that and I have seen this in there they've got lots of comic booky stuff like I know they've got scarves and stuff and I kept looking at that and I kept thinking now I won't get it I haven't got anything to use it with and now I have and I'm just like Yee! so very excited so um, I'll do a quick little update while I'm here. I'm feeling better. You can probably tell because I'm like all happy. Um, I have had some problems just recently like um, with people in my personal life. But as far as I know, we're now completely sorted. Um, me and all the people who are involved. But um, that was really like getting me down. But like I said, as far as I know, we're all sorted now. There is still one issue kind of going on, but I will deal with that as and when I need to. Um, but I'm just, I am feeling a lot more positive. I mean, I've been on my tablets three weeks and a day now. Um, and I mean, the doctor told me that it can take a few weeks for it to get into my system. Like most people, it takes at least a month. Well, I do feel a change and Mark said there's been a change in me, which is good. Um, I've got another four weeks worth set out there waiting for me so technically I've took one today so I've got six days left in this pack and then I've got a full week's worth I've got the rest of this week off today's Thursday so I've got the rest of this week off work I've got next week off work I've got the week after off work because we're going on holiday um, and then I'm going back to work so that's going to be a bit of a challenge because I'll have had six weeks off which I was not intending to have that much time off I was expecting to have like two maybe three weeks maximum and then I went back to the doctor and he said you're not ready you need to go back you need to have some more time off before you go back so at the moment it's just like I don't know I am really enjoying my time off and it's helping to kind of relax and I still have a lot of stress because obviously most of the time I'm here on my own with Immy and Immy can be a bit of a handful but now she's back at school she's calmed down a little bit which is good um but yeah, in general, I have felt better, which is good. I do still get headaches. I mean, I've got a bit of a headache coming on now. I think that's just because I'm a bit tired. Um, but yeah, I'm just trying to relax and enjoy myself while I'm off and make the most of it, really, before I go back to work. So yeah, that's about it, really. But yes, I am feeling better. So thank you to everybody who's kind of been sending well wishes and asking how I am and stuff. That is how I am at the moment. If there was any sort of drastic change and I really went back downhill, then I would kind of let you guys know so that you knew what was going on. I did feel really down the other day and I recorded a little clip, but um, I'm not going to publish it because it's, it's just me feeling sorry for myself and I, I don't want I don't want that to come across. I don't want people sort of feeling sorry for me and feeling like they have to give me sympathy and stuff so that clip I'm just going to delete it because it doesn't mean anything anyway and the things that I was upset about I'm not upset about now so it doesn't matter um I don't know what's happened to my accent I've kind of gone from Fenny to a bit mank or something I don't know <laughs> my accent changes so much as mom goes um yes so that is pretty much all I've got to say today um it's very hot in my house I keep getting really hot, I don't like it, but never mind. That's why I haven't got any makeup on, because I you know, just sweat off. It's just bleh. I do need to do another video, because I've only done one for my looks so far, so I need to do the second one, which is going to be the Michelle Fan look. But I've had some really interesting requests for the next one, so I'm going to sort of have a look through and see what I think of them all, and see if I can find any looks that I like that I want to kind of recreate. So that'll be interesting. Um, but yeah, that's it for today guys, so like I said, thank you to everybody who's kind of been well wishing and stuff like that. Hello to my new subscribers, I have got some new subscribers, I think I'm currently sitting at 465, which I'm really impressed at considering I've not really been 
doing that many videos in April, I'm impressed that I'm still getting people kind of subscribing. So thank you to everybody and hello all you new lovely people. Um, so yeah, I, I'm going to love you and leave you all there. So I will see you all really, really soon. I miss you all um, and I will be catching up with comments and stuff as soon as I can. I haven't been on the computer that much, so I've not been able to kind of catch up with comments. But I will be, I promise I will reply to each and every one of you. And I will speak to you all soon. Bye guys, love you all.